Hi, Kevin Johnson here with One Blue Real Estate School, and welcome back for another episode of our real estate math tutorials. Today, we're gonna to talk about calculating the cost of discount points. Now, what are these things? Let's talk about make sure we have a good understanding of what they are. Mortgage points are also known as discount points, or the fees a borrower pays to the lender at closing in exchange for a lower interest rate. One point costs 1% of the total mortgage amount, or basically $1,000 for every $100,000 of the loan amount. Essentially, the borrower is paying some of the interest up front. That way they can have a lower payment over the term of the entire loan. It's also called buying down the rate. So we pay a little bit of cash up front at closing, that monthly payment, the interest rate over the life of the loan is lower. All right, so let's look at an example. Borrower's getting a mortgage loan in the amount of $120,000. In order to lower the interest rate, the lender is charging the buyer two points. How much does the borrower have to pay at closing for the points? So it's for every point, we just change the point to a percentage. So two points, 2%, two percent, three points, three percent, okay? So we're going to take the $120,000 mortgage amount, and we're gonna multiply that by 2% because it's two points. So our answer, $2,400. Pretty straightforward. So remember, whatever the points are, just put a percent sign next to it. So two points, 2%, two percent, five points, five percent, 10 points, 10 percent. Whatever the points are, make it a percent. All right, now I've got two practice questions for you, so let's give it a try. Here's the first one for you. What are the cost of points for a $350,000 FHA loan with 6% interest and three points? Hit pause, find out the cost of the points, and when you think you have the answer, hit play. All right, what did you come up with? The correct answer is 10,500. Did you get like 21,000? If you did get 21,000, let's look at the question carefully. 6% interest, the points, three, three points. So what we did here is we kind of tricked your brain if you did it that way. If you got 21,000, you were not reading the question carefully. If you got 10,500, congratulations, you read the question. The state exam, part of what they're doing is making sure you're paying attention to details. You're gonna be helping someone buy or sell probably the largest financial transaction in their lives. Details matter, all right? Now that you know my trickery, let's try another one. Oh, there's the math for you, right? Let's try another one. What are the cost of points for a $200,000 loan with a 4.25% interest rate and two points? Hit pause. When you have the answer, hit play. All right, what did you get? Did I trick you again? Did you get 4,000? All right, if you did, great job. There's your math, 200,000. It's two points, so 2%, 200,000 times 0.02, $4,000. That's the answer. Hopefully you found this beneficial and it helped clear up any confusion on how to calculate the cost of points. If you need more help, don't forget you can check out our on-demand exam prep class at onebluerealestateschool.com. We have hundreds of practice questions, flashcards, and the entire book, the entire 63 hour course broken down in two to five minute videos to help you drill down on the things you're having challenges with. In the meantime, thank you so much for watching. Be sure to hit subscribe, like, follow, click on the bell, all the good things depending on where you're watching so that you can be notified the next time we share a new video. Have a great day.